Hi, this is Colleen, and I put this video together because I want to do a demonstration on how you can make videos with your photography. I know you've seen the videos, and you probably wish that you could do it, but you might have assumed that they're too complicated or complex, and they are, but they've got software to do all that complicated, fancy, smancy stuff, and that's what I want to demonstrate to you today. There's a lot of different software you can use to make videos. Uh, some are just easier to use than others. This one is relatively easy. It's called Animoto. You may have heard of it. I'm sure you've seen the videos that they made. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate to you how to make it. And then I'm going to show you versions of the same uh, set of photos made, different versions of the video made with the same photos. And I want to demonstrate to you how easy it is. And I'm going to make this video in less than three or four minutes. Really, it's that fast. Now, I've been doing it a while, and there was a slight learning curve, but it was easier than learning email. I promise you that. And if you're a photographer that want to display your work, then you need to watch this video, and then watch the videos below this. Watch this. You're going to learn some things. And, oh, by the way, Animoto is free. You can make free videos. Let your imagination run wild. Watch the video. In this video, I want to demonstrate to you how easy it is to use Animoto. Many of you have asked me about some of the complexities, apparent complexities of Animoto, and I want to show you that it's, it's a powerful piece of software, but it's not that complex. The music that comes that is associated with the video is produced or offered by Animoto. In this case I have the pro version but the free version will do you well. I just have the pro version so I'm going to demonstrate to you how I make videos using Animoto so I can show you how simple it is. I'm going to go to create video and here we have they have holiday styles that you can choose. Let me just click on one to show you. You can click on it and it gives a preview of what it looks like. Okay, so that's for the holiday season. Now, my favorite, I don't know why that keeps popping up. I've got to straighten that out. My favorite is this particular one, the Animoto Original. However, I'm, I'm limited like that. They have quite a few that they offer. In fact, as I mentioned, I have the pro version of Animoto, so I have access to these. And for the purpose of this demonstration video, I'm going to make one of them using this style. Because it caters to demonstrating photography. Animoto does that all the way around but certain uh, themes do a better job. So here we are and now we're going to put our video together. We've already selected the style. Now we're going to choose the photos. I can choose from my computer, get them from Facebook or Picasso, Flickr, Photo Bucket, Smugbug or any other thing like that. I choose to get them from my computer. In this case, often I edit them with Picasa, and I can do a lot and make a put an album together. So here we are on my computer. I select the photos that I want. It loads. Next, as they're loading, I need to choose the music. And here there is a selection, as I was saying to you earlier, Animoto provides the music. I prefer instrumentals. They have quite a few just... I don't know if you can hear that, but I just want to show you the variation. Let's get to the video. Now, here are the photos, but I would want to put text in there.
Okay, so that's the text box. I can move it anywhere in the rotation. I'm going to put another one in. I'm just giving you examples here. Once again, we can move it around. Now, you can select different photos. Let me try that again. And highlight them. I had to eliminate this because the text, you cannot highlight the text box. And when they're highlighted in the video, they'll stay, uh, the video stays on them longer. Next is where I've been adding text. And you've seen me type that in already. I'm going through this real fast, but I do want you to get an idea. Let your imagination wonder and see how you can use it. And then it's a matter of just pressing the button. And then you wait, and it goes into this format, and that's it. I didn't have a clock going, but I just wanted to show you how quick that is. And now I'm going to show you a part of the end result of the video. All right, I know I went through that real fast, but I certainly hope I've demonstrated to you how simple it is to take your photos and make valuable videos with them. Animoto is free. I have the pro version, of course, I'm paying. You get a little bit more when you pay the pro version, but you can make some fantastic videos of your photos for free with Animoto. Now, I'm going to show you in the rest of this video the same set of videos with the same music, just different themes. So use your imagination. In this case, we're showing you uh, nature photos, but it could just as easily be portraits, business photos, landscapes, or whatever your niche is. Use your imagination and watch the rest of this video. Well, that's it. All you need to do now is click the Animoto link below and go make your versions of your own videos. Watch the videos below. They're the long version of the snippets you saw in this particular video. But what's more important for you right now, certainly you can watch videos I make. Click the link, the Animoto link below. Find out where your photos are, either online or in a folder on your computer. Upload them, make your videos, and show your work. After all, photography is made to be seen, isn't it? Now you know how to use Animoto to show your stuff. I wish you the best in your photography future. Thank you for watching.